gonna be on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Tell me what do you have in mind? Tell me what do you have in mind? Good morning. In the first two videos, I focused on the central core of Osaka, Minami and Kita, with a bonus including the castle area. Today, we're south. This is Tenoji. The idea for today is to see two places that hold records in Japan, the tallest building in the entire country. And actually, it's this one right here. <laughs> but we'll be back later today because we'll start with the oldest Buddhist temple in Japan. Here we are. Shintenoji, the oldest Buddhist temple in the country. <laughs> the old and the new, huh? Temple right here, tallest building in Japan, right there. to bring good fortune. Wow, how many turtles here? You're just admiring them? Yeah. It doesn't look like this is one temple. It looks like there are various here. Five-story pagoda. That's the famous landmark of this temple. 300 yen to go to the main area. Arigato gozaimasu. Just missing the blue sky. Inside the pagoda, there are thousands of miniatures of these same pagodas. Very interesting. And I thought there was a view up there, but no. You really just go up to see the structure inside. Stairs all the way to the fifth floor. Another amazing temple here, but unfortunately, no photos either. Right here is one of the most beautiful temples I've ever seen. It's totally dark, and they use lights in different ways to set the tone. It's just a shame you cannot photograph. Right here in the patio, they show what appears to be historic ceramics discovered buried here. Can't know for sure because everything is in Japanese. The original temple here was built in the year 593, but unfortunately, not everything remained exactly like in those days. A lot was destroyed by war and natural disasters. evacuation route in case of a disaster. In Japan, everything is so planned out and well thought in advance. Is it here? That way? This is Tenoji Park. Such a nice area, huh? Yes. So beautiful, everywhere. It's good I take you places like this. <laughs> You're so nice. Wait for me, we'll be there. Keita Kuen. Keita Kuen Garden. Keita Kuen. Keita Kuen. Keita Kuen. Okay. <laughs> no discount because of rain? Uh, no discount. <laughs> <laughs> Arigato gozaimasu. The park was beautiful, but we're now going to see something even more beautiful. A traditional Japanese garden. We're gonna cross. <laughs> oh, oh, it's full of fish. <laughs> Everything that characterizes a typical Japanese garden here a pond, bridges, and a tea house. I'd be eaten alive. Yeah. What about you? There's a bunch of bugs. <laughs> yes. Should wear a mosquito repellent when you come here. What's unique about this garden here was created by the person who established the modern Japanese garden making, Ogawa Jihei. Look 
Congratulations! <laughs> this garden here belonged to a very important and wealthy family here in Osaka called Sumitomo. And then in 1926, the 15th generation of this family donated a garden to the city of Osaka. And if this was the garden, that was their house. Today is the Museum of Art. This is a really beautiful park, perfect to take all kinds of pictures here. They're taking wedding pictures over there, but seriously, you gotta wear mosquito repellent here. For us, it's been 30 minutes and I'm already all bit. We just discovered a small Shinto shrine here. It's so charming. What I told you about standing on the right, mm -hmm. now you realize. Yeah, Osaka is different. Yep. And this might be good to try. Pork omelet. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Hey, you're working. <laughs> we wanted to try another specialty here in Osaka. We immediately came to this restaurant when we saw their name, Okonomiyaki. It's kind of a pancake with a lot of things in the middle. We chose pork, beef, shrimp. Squid. There's a lot of stuff that comes together and they're gonna prepare it right here. Wow. Arigato kasamas. Good? Mm -hmm. So good. What does it remind you of? It's an omelette. An omelette? Yeah. Yeah? Does it have eggs? Yeah? Mm, wow! So many flavors! It reminds me a little bit of takoyaki. It was so good! Big one for me! <laughs> it was so, so good! If you come to Osaka, you gotta try their typical dishes here. We are now in the tallest building in Japan, Abeno Harukas. Here they have Japan's largest department wow. store. There's an art museum, Marriott Hotel, shops, offices, restaurants, and two observation bags. If you want to go to the museum, this way. If you want to go to the observation bag, that way. There's a sky garden here on the 16th floor. Free views of the city. There, the park and the Japanese garden, where we were. On rainy days, at least you have the advantage of not having to fight crowds. It's basically empty. Entrance to the second and main observation back here costs 1,500 yen. But for a rainy day like this, we'll pass. People here did the same. There's nobody in line. The view from up there is obviously much higher. It would be nice on a clear day. <laughs> This store here is called Kintetsu. It goes from two levels below ground until the 11th floor. It's enormous! The store has a floor guide here, detailing what you find in each floor. What do you think of a hat for you? It's a lot of class. It's what? Cool. No, are you supposed to? It's a lovely smile. Yeah, <laughs> it likes. <laughs> We now walked into this area here called Shinsekai. It was a 15-minute walk from Abeno Harukas, and here there are two highlights. The tower, Senkaku Tower, and also Jenjen Yokocho. The food here looks extremely cheap. This is a place where um, laborers who rebuilt Osaka after World War II gathered. Look at the takoyakis here. We paid 600 for eight. Here they're serving six for 350 yen. Can't be that big. Oh my god. 
can't be. Look at that plate of fries. No way. The food is cheap here. Yeah. Look at that beer. That's five crazy. Bucks for that beer. I'm paying five bucks for a small one. It's a big one here. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go on. There you go. Right there, right now. It's from the basement. Right Two, please. How much? 800. I got those in us. Since 1956. Yeah. Can I cut it? Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. We got crackers. Or just the best you've ever had. Welcome to Tutankhamun Tower. We ended up coming up to the top of the other tower. This is Tutankhamun Tower. We figured that at night the rain wouldn't matter much and we'd have a nice city view. Plus, this is 800 yen, almost half the price of Harukas 300. Let me introduce you to Bilikin. This is the deity of good fortune who will grant any wish. Any wish? Any wish. There's a Billiken Beatles. There's a Billiken Elvis too. And Marilyn Monroe. And Charles Shapley. And Michael Jackson. Two floors here with totally different vibes. When you come down one floor, it's like a nightclub. This was the tallest structure in entire East Asia at the time it was built in 1912. And it shocked people at that time. Well, but this is not the same tower since 1912 because it was torn down. They had a fire in 43 and they dismantled the tower to supply steel for the war. During World War II, they dismantled this tower because they needed steel, you know, for the wartime economy. And this one right now was rebuilt afterwards. So here they don't have the same infrastructure as I imagine the other probably does. This is not as modern and there's a lot of reflection here on the glass. Here's the main question, will it rain tomorrow? I don't know. You can tell there's a weather forecast on top of the tower. Yeah. So what does it say? It's red and blue. We have a guide here. Red and blue. Rain? Very bad. <laughs> no, red. Blue for rain and red for very torrential. No. It's cloudy with rain later. It's good. At least it's not a beautiful sunny day the day we leave Japan. Yeah, this is the last video of this entire trip to Japan. And here in Osaka, you probably noticed I didn't even show Universal Studios, the Bay Area. I could have gone from day trips to Kyoto, to Kobe, to Nara. So if you come here to Japan, don't stay just in Tokyo. Get the bullet train and go visit the entire nation. It's a fantastic country and I'll be back. <laughs> What's your wish? I can't tell you. Oh, come on. Come on. Nope. It's a secret. I <laughs> <laughs> mean, Billiken. <laughs> Billiken and I. That's it. No, no, I'm getting freaked out now. Uh, <laughs> it's kind of funny. <laughs> he doesn't like you, Gordon. You know the biblical story? Oh, what? They've never found Noah's Ark. Yeah. The biblical story, Noah's Ark. Uh. I go down in history, I found it. Noah's Ark? <laughs> You're so funny.